tomb of Jesus. That's what this is. That's where we are. And I'm holding, as we stand here, I'm holding the, a copy of the book of Enoch to the thin air. And you know there are angels at your side, both to the right and to the left. And I'm guessing the fact that you're watching my videos, the fact you've made it this far in to one of my videos, means that those aren't even, those aren't just angels that are at your side. While you're sitting there and you think to yourself, I'm all alone, it's all falling apart, why is this happening to me? That you've not only got angels to your right and to your left, in every room you walk in, but more than that, that these are unusual angels at your side, I'm willing to guess, and that'll be brought up again. And why are they? Why would that be the case? Why is something attacking you? Because if something's attacking, I mean, it's not attacking the guy over there, or the guy over there. Oh no, but something's got a special interest in you, doesn't it? I wonder why that is. Maybe it's because when you turn things to another angle, another dimension, maybe it's because darkness loves to pile on you, doesn't it? <laughs> I guess I see something you don't. You see something you don't, that if you could actually see that you were, if you could see you like God sees you, oh, does darkness like to cover what it sees? <laughs> well, it just gave away a secret, didn't it? It's scared of you. Things in another dimension, as close as the air between your fingertips, are scared 